Luckily, we have created an in-depth guide that will help you immensely. We will be explaining what a scant cup is, how much is a scant cup, how to measure a scant cup, and so much more. Now, you never have to waste time searching for the answer again. What does scant cup mean? The word scant is defined as barely sufficient. When the word is used to describe measuring a cup of ingredients, it means that the amount should be a tiny bit less than a cup, aka, not packed to the top. This word can also be used to describe the amounts used when measuring with teaspoons or tablespoons. How much is a scant cup? A scant cup is usually two tablespoons less than a full cup. You can also use 210 milliliters. However, there are a few factors to consider and a few ways to measure this. First, measuring it by volume is possible, but less accurate. You should rather measure a scant cup by weight. However, in doing so there is another problem you will run into. So, you will have to convert the cups to grams for each specific ingredient. How do you measure a scant cup? A regular cup is measured by scooping the ingredients into the cup itself, then leveling the top using a straight edge. You should never tamp down the ingredients unless the recipe calls for it, especially dry ingredients. Tamping down a cup means banging it so that the ingredient is more compact. Method 1. Eyeball it. Fill the cup to about 7 eighths full. This will be slightly below the top of the cup or below the full cup indicator line. Method 2. Measure a cup and remove. Subtract 30 milliliters from 240 milliliters. This leaves you with 210 milliliters. To use this method, you can measure out one cup of your ingredient and remove two tablespoons of it. You can also use six teaspoons. Method 3. Measuring exactly. This is the most accurate method you can use, but sometimes it requires some calculating. You can accurately measure a scant cup using volume or weight. Weight is much more accurate. Where the difficulty comes in is that different ingredients have different weights by volume. One scant cup is about 210 milliliters. You can use this site to help you convert the volume of an ingredient to a weight. Then, you can weigh it out using a scale exactly. How many grams is a scant cup of flour? This depends entirely on the type of flour you use. As we have mentioned before, Different ingredients have different weights by volume. This also applies to flour. As you can see from our helpful table, flour-like all-purpose flour is much denser and therefore weighs a lot more than compared to something like rye flour. While a gram or two difference won't ruin your recipe, when it comes to larger gaps, it certainly will. If you liked this video don't forget to like and subscribe.